Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing a Shein haul. This time I've bought this Shein haul with my own money. I was supposed to be looking for a birthday gift for my mum but I ended up buying a ton of stuff for myself as well. Uh, so sorry mum. I mean you still got a birthday present but I've got a ton of stuff for myself too. So most of this stuff is actually more clothing from the Care Bears collection. I just really want to collect most of the Care Bears collection because it honestly looks so cute. I honestly had to stop myself from buying all of it because I would have broken my bank. But I don't have just clothing. I've also got some decorations and stuff to show you guys that I got for my room as well. This isn't a sponsored video, I just really love Shein. Even before I started sponsoring with Shein, I was doing Shein hauls like with my own money and everything. So yeah, I'm really excited to show you guys what I've got today and everything looks so cute. I've had a look at everything before this video and I can't wait to show you guys. So let's get right into it. So I actually have one accessory to show you guys as well, but the rest of this is all decor that I got for my room. So you might have noticed that in the last few videos I haven't had my lights up in the background, and that's because one set of lights that I've got is broken, so I had to get some new ones. I'm going to take all of these lights around my room down, and the ones around my posters as well, because the ones around my posters are the ones that are broken. So I'm going to take all of them down and I'm just going to start again. So I got some new lights because these lights were from Shein as well. I wanted to get some new ones. So these are the ones that I got. They're basically the same except I got multicolour this time. These were just plain like Christmas light sort of things but I wanted to get some multicoloured lights and they're just string lights as well. They're pretty. I think I don't know how much I got them for. I think they were like £4 or something. So they were pretty cheap. I knew that they wouldn't last forever. I think I've had the ones in my room for over a year now. So they are due to be replaced. I mean, if you get cheap lights, what do you expect? I got some new ones. These are multicoloured lights. I got the 5 meter one, so they will fit all around my room. I'm not going to put them around my posters, mainly because they're just really annoying. And they're starting to look really messy as well, because I'm getting more posters to go around my room too. So I just don't really see that looking nice anymore so I've got these multicolored ones and it also comes with a remote so you can change the setting which I think is really good as well my other ones didn't come with a remote so I like this as well they are USB lights as well so I don't have to put any batteries in and worry about replacing batteries or anything so I got these and they're not the only lights that I got as well if you watch my Christmas machine for last year then I got very similar lights to these that I'm about to show you. I'm not going to take them out of the packet because I had a really bad struggle of trying to get them out in my Christmas machine haul last year and they're all tangled up. So I'm just going to leave them in the packet but basically I'll put a picture of what they look like here. So these lights I'm going to be putting around my bed and I think they will look so cute. These are multicolour as well. They're basically the same multicolour as these ones so they'll match and yeah I'm really excited to get some more lights up in my room because at the minute none of my lights work so I need to replace them. But those are the lights that I've got for my room. The next thing that I've got for decor is this cat shelf. This did arrive apart as well so you have to put this together. I really loved the look of this shelf but mainly because it was a cat. It's kind of small though. I was kind of wishing that it was going to be bigger. I think that's something that happens a lot on Shein. Like they make things look bigger than they actually are but it is kind of small but it will fit all of my crystals on them. I just wanted a shelf for my crystals because at the minute my crystals are sitting on my windowsill which is good because if you know anything about crystals leaving them on your windowsill is good for like cleansing them because the when the moonlight hits them at night time it's supposed to cleanse your crystals but I also have a crystal cleanser as well that I got for my birthday so I don't think it'll be much of an issue to change over to putting them on a shelf but I just think that this looked incredibly witchy and the part for my crystal collection and I honestly think it's perfect I don't have a big crystal collection I have a few rose quartz and my other birth stones and everything like that so I'm going to be putting them on this little shelf and I think it's going to be so cute. So that is all the decor for my room that I got but I got one bit of accessory and it is this hat. I wasn't really sure about getting this because I've seen other people wear it and they look so cute with it. It's more of like a kawaii fashion sort of thing so I wasn't really sure if I'd suit it but I've seen other people wear these before and they look so cute especially with a put together outfit as well. I think it would look really cute but I don't know how I'd look with it. It's one of these cat bonnets. 
So it's basically a bonnet with cat ears on it. Let me just show you guys what it looks like. It does look really cute. And I think with the right outfit, it will look really nice. But I put it on and it kind of looked a bit silly on me. It does look very cute though. I was just very drawn to it because of how cute it looks. It does look really nice. So I think with the right outfit, it'll look nice. But like I said, I wasn't really sure about it. I'm not sure if it's something that I could pull off. But a lot of people look so cute with them on. And it's a very like kawaii fashion sort of thing. I just thought it looked really cute. And I do like it. I think I might be able to put an outfit together with this. But like I said, it was a little bit of a risk because I'm not really sure how I'd look with one of these on my head. But I don't think it looks too bad. I think when I first put it on, I was like, oh my god, I'm not sure what I think about this but yeah I think I can make this work I think it looks better when I've got my makeup on I think if you got the right sort of makeup on it looks nice but if you're just wearing it randomly I just don't think you look the part you just look like somebody with a bonnet on but yeah I think it looks really cute so that is all the decor and the accessory that I got from Shein and we're going to move on to the clothing now like I said it's mostly stuff from the Care Bears collection but there is one thing that I want to show you guys that I've been wanting to get for a really long time actually so I'm really excited to get into that for you guys so let's go okay to start with there's this Care Bears skirt and it's lilac I absolutely love the color lilac one of my favourite colours ever. And the pattern on this skirt is so gorgeous. I'll come and show you guys up close in a minute. But I absolutely love the shape of this skirt. I feel like it just curves me in all the right places. It's rutched up the sides as well, which gives me a little bit more shape. And honestly, I just think it looks so cute. Although when I bought the skirt, it was a little bit misleading because I thought it was part of a set. Um, I thought the top that was pictured with this skirt was coming with the skirt, but it didn't. So I was really shocked when I just got the skirt. But I should have double checked that. But to be honest, I've got plenty of shirts that would go with this skirt, like this one. I mainly got this top out to go with this skirt. So it does look very cute together, honestly. So there's this strange little strappy bit up here. So I think this skirt is meant to be a bit low rising so you can wrap this around your stomach so that's basically what I did so I feel like this is something that you could wear to sort of help boost your confidence a little bit I mean as you can see here I've got a little stomach roll um, just slipping out here but it doesn't really bother me if having stomach rolls is something that bothers you then maybe this might be something quite daring and something just to help you with your confidence a little bit because wearing stuff like this really helped me with my confidence and I used to look at my stomach rolls as if they were something to be embarrassed about but I just feel like it's just part of the outfit now <laughs> if you guys know what I mean. And I just think it looks so cute. I mean look at this pattern as well. Can you see the pattern is just so cute. I love it so much and I really do love this strappy bit as well. I just think it's a little bit different. Add something a little bit different to the outfit. Honestly I have nothing bad to say about this. Also it goes really nicely with this top as well mainly because they're both lilac but I really do love this skirt and yeah so if you're somebody who struggles with their confidence and has stomach rolls a bit like me and also I have a big stomach as well so wearing like skirts like this that hug your stomach can be a little bit daunting to start off with as well but honestly I really love it and I think it really helps just wearing something a little bit out of your comfort zone because it really does help you with your confidence even if it's just like building it up gradually and slowly because that's basically what I did I mean a few years ago I would have looked at this and thought oh I hate it but I'm looking at it right now and I absolutely love it I really do I think it looks so cute also I feel a little bit stupid I didn't notice this about the skirt before but these two strings here you can pull the skirt up at the front and then strap the straps around you which honestly makes a lot more sense let's see how it looks like with the skirt pulled up a little bit at the front yeah that makes a lot more sense so this is basically what it looks like pulled up a little bit at the front. With a lot of bodycon skirts, the, a lot of the skirts don't have much shape and sometimes they can hang off a lot of people, especially for people like me because I have a very straight up and down figure. So having something like this where it can sort of bring it in a little bit to give you a little bit more shape is perfect as well. I absolutely love this feature on it, which I didn't even notice to start off with, but it's a good job that I noticed that before I tried on the next piece. 
Also, I wanted to show you guys the back because I, I read a comment in my last video that I don't show the back of clothing that much. So I'm going to start doing that. I just remembered about that too. So here you go guys. This is the back of this skirt. Also, you can see like here the straps if I come closer. Yeah, you can see the straps as well. Just like around the back and you can tighten it up to however you want it to fit and i just think it looks so gorgeous right now i really love it especially with this tied up because i feel like it hugs my body a little bit more so yeah so this next clothing piece is another skirt it is another care bear skirt as you can see the pattern is at the bottom like near the hem of the skirt and I loved the colour of the skirt. I've been wanting this skirt for so, so long. And I think it looks so cute. Just how I imagined it to be. It has an elasticated waist, which is an amazing thing about the skirts from the Care Bear collection. When she first started, I bet most plus size people can relate to this. But they only ever had zip enclosure skirts, which just never, ever fitted me. I tried one skirt and it just didn't fit me. So I just never looked at Sheen skirts again. But once they expanded a little bit, they kind of listened to their customers and they started bringing out more skirts with elasticated waistbands which is absolutely amazing for somebody like me who can never find a skirt that can fit me and I absolutely love it it's got a lot of room in here as well a lot of wiggle room in here and I love the pale yellow color of it as well as you guys know I am a sucker for pastel colors so this is perfect for me and like I said I've just had my eye on this skirt for so long and I'm so glad I finally got it it also looks really nice with this top as well mainly because they're both pastel colors so it kind of goes together really well if you'd like to have a little look at the pattern it's just little care bears at the bottom of the skirt all the different care bears i just think it looks so so cute look i've got a shirt that has that care bear on so that will go with that shirt as well so yeah i'm really pleased with the skirt i've got nothing bad to say about this either there's a lot of room in here i absolutely love the pattern and the feel of the skirt it just it's just amazing i love it I just wanted to show you guys the back of this skirt as well. This is what it looks like at the back. I know a lot of people struggle with the length of skirts. I do as well. It's one of the most annoying things about getting skate skirts because they always ride up at the back. But this one really does cover you up at the back. It's basically the same length as it is at the front, which is really amazing too. So just one last look of how it looks. I knew it was going to be a bit on the longer side as well because it looked longer on the model. So this is what it looks like at the back and at the front. So this next clothing piece isn't from the Care Bears collection but I've been wanting a piece like this for ages. This is sort of a tennis styled skater skirt. I've always wanted one of these white skater skirts because I've always seen girls who are into kawaii fashion wear one of these but I can never find one that would fit me or that has an elasticated waist which this one has. This one has a very big elasticated waist and there's a lot of room in here as well so I'm really happy about that. And and I think this is probably the first one that I found in this style that actually does have an elasticated waist because all of them that I've ever seen on Shein on any clothing website has a zip enclosure and I just knew it wouldn't fit me or wouldn't have enough room for me. Another great thing about this skirt is there's shorts underneath and it also just feels very good quality as well. I didn't expect it to be this sort of material. It's kind of like a crinkly material but it doesn't really bother me that much. And I just love the style of it. As you can see, it kind of gives me a little bit of a waist, a little bit of an illusion of having some shape around my waist. And I just love it. I love the way it looks so much. And as you guys know, I'm really into kawaii, like cute fashion. And I've always wanted one of these in my wardrobe. So I'm really happy that I can finally have one of these. And yeah, I absolutely love it. It's everything that I imagined it to be. Also, because I'm so short, I can kind of get away with having these skirts because they kind of sit like a normal skirt would on me but like i said the amazing thing about this is that it squats so no worries that if it's too short on you because you have a little bit of protection down here that's covering you up so that is another plus about this is that it is like a mini skirt but you've got a little bit of cover up down here with the shorts as well 
and honestly I just love it so much it's everything that I wanted it to be I've kind of wanted one of these for ages like I said so I'm really excited about it again it really goes well with this top I think I did a really good choice here like putting this top on because it's gone with everything that I've put on so far but yeah I think it's so cute and I really love the two layers to it as well it just adds more oomph around here like I said gives me a little bit of a waist which I don't really have so yeah I'm really happy with this one too. I also just wanted to show you guys the back of this skirt as well because I'm trying to show you guys the back of all my outfits as well so you guys know what it looks like on the back and yeah so this is what it looks like at the back basically the same as it looks like on the front I know a lot of people think when you buy skirts that they're going to be like riding up at the back I know I get it a lot too with my skirts as well but this seems like it pretty much covers you at the back as well which is really good so that's a plus too so this is the last piece of clothing that I got and it is a Care Bears bodycon dress it looks so gorgeous I am absolutely in love with this pattern I absolutely love the front here as well like there's frills around this little picture of the two Care Bears on the front and I absolutely love it I love the color scheme of it as well the color scheme of the whole Care Bears collection is just the whole of my style like that that is the colors that I will wear it's just all pastel colors all cutesy sort of styles and it's just stuff that I like so I really love this skirt it's very stretchy as well it's a little bit on the tighter side around my stomach but it's not too bad and I'm actually kind of glad that it's a little bit tight around here like it's not tight where I feel like I'm trapped in but it just feels like it's a little bit snug but I'd much rather that so I can keep control of my bust and my belly it looks so cute I'm absolutely in love with it the straps are also perfect length for me as well like it's not too low it's not too high they are just perfect and I'll show you guys the back of the dress as well this is the back of the dress and what it looks like and it's just the plain pattern on the back there's nothing special on the back there but this little cute picture on the front is just so cute I'm absolutely in love with it I love the frills around here it is just such a cute part of the dress yeah I'm absolutely in love with this I have nothing bad to say about anything that I've got today like honestly I'm in love with it all and it's everything that I expected it to be and like I said I just want to buy the whole of the Care Bears collection it just looks absolutely beautiful and I just want all of it because it's got all the colour schemes that I like, all the patterns that I like, and also I used to really like Care Bears when I was younger, so yeah, it's just nostalgic as well, isn't it? So I just want the whole collection, it's just so cute. And yeah, this is the last piece, and I'm just in love with everything. If you love Care Bears, you need to get to Shein and have a look at their huge Care Bears collection, because I'll be definitely going back there, because I'm so happy with everything that I got today. So that is everything that I've got to review from Shein today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, I know I did, I absolutely love filming Shein hauls, and as you can tell I'm really excited about everything that I got today, I absolutely love the Care Bears collection, and I'm so glad that I was able to get some more stuff from there. If you like the look of anything in the Shein haul, I'll link everything that I reviewed in today's video in the caption below along with a link to the Shein website if you would just like to browse. If you want to check out any of my other social medias I'll put a link to my link tree which contains all the social medias that I'm on in the caption below as well. I do have a code with Shein, I know this isn't a partnership with Shein but I really do want to share my code with you guys just because it's out there and if you guys want to go and order from Shein after this video or in the future then you have a code to use. It's Makeup Barry Drinkle 15 I'll put it on the screen now for you guys to get 15% off your order. If you guys have a question for me or you just want to DM me then I'm most likely to see that on my Snapchat so go ahead and subscribe to me on Snapchat that is where I interact with my followers the most. If you're new here, I do creative makeup and fashion videos, so if that sounds like your sort of thing, I'd love for you to join my community, so hit the subscribe button. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up because it really does help me out. Thank you so much for sticking around for so long, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!